Hey everyone, welcome back to a new video here on the channel. In today's video, we have some pretty big Ninjago news, and I totally did not just wake up. It's usually how it goes here. I wake up and there's some big Ninjago news happening, and today we actually got ourselves a first look at the Summer 2022 set list for Ninjago. Now this information comes courtesy of Promo Bricks, as per usual. The image that we're going to be using in today's video is obviously from their own source, so once again, feel free to check out Promo Bricks and let's get into these sets. Now these sets, I'm not sure if these are supposed to be, again, Ninjago Core or Ninjago Season 16. Not exactly sure what these sets are for, necessarily, but we do have a big list of Summer 2022 sets, and these sets sound pretty crazy. So let's go ahead and talk through these. So first things first, we have set number 71759, Ninja Dragon Temple. This is a 4 plus set, retailing for $39.99 USD. Uh, four plus set, another junior set. Not exactly sure what this one will be like. It seems like it's going to be a pretty big temple. Uh, for $40, though, it might be pretty small. Think about the most recent uh, Destiny's Bounty uh, that came out of juniors. It's probably going to be around that size. Probably not anything too major. And since it is a four plus set, I'm not really going to be too interested in grabbing it, though it just depends. If it does have some interesting things in it, I will probably grab it. But the Ninja Dragon Temple, yeah, not exactly sure what this one's gonna be. It seems like this entire wave is focused on dragons to an extent, so that should be interesting. Next up, we have set number 71768, Jay's Golden Dragon Motorbike for $19.99. Again, another Golden Dragon set. Seems like this entire wave is gonna be dragon focused, but this is gonna be a motorbike for Jay. Might be one of those oversized bikes that we see from Ninjago so much, so I wouldn't really expect anything else. For $19.99, it certainly does seem like one of those oversized bikes. I'm curious to see how they're going to make a dragon bike. Are they going to make it like in the shape of a dragon? Is it going to be a dragon themed motorcycle? I guess we're just going to have to wait and see. Then we have set number 71769, Cole's Golden Dragon Cruiser. Sounds like the exact same thing, except maybe a, a car or something. Maybe some type of land vehicle for $39.99. Again, this could be pretty much anything. Golden Dragon Cruiser? Sounds to me like it's going to be some type of car, maybe in the shape of a dragon or perhaps dragon themed. For some reason, I'm thinking Chima vehicles, but perhaps instead of, you know, various animals, they are all dragon themed vehicles and maybe every single vehicle is going to be gold. Not sure what the whole golden dragon theme is for this season, but uh, yeah, uh, Cole's Golden Dragon Cruiser, $39.99. Sounds interesting. It's a Cole vehicle. I'm looking forward to it. Then we have here set number 71770, Zane's Golden Dragon Raider for $29.99. Again, a Raider sounds to me like one of those half-track vehicles, and it is going to be for Zane, and it is Golden Dragon themed, so expect a Dragon themed half-track, similar to the Thunder Raider, similar to the Ultrasonic Raider, um, to me that's just what comes to mind, and this one is going to be for Zane. So yeah, Zane gets a vehicle, Cole gets a vehicle, and Jay gets a vehicle. That's interesting, and we have one for Kai coming up too. This wave sounds pretty crazy, all things considered. Then we have set number number 71771, The Dark Temple, which retails for $79.99. This sounds like it could very well be a villain type base. I, I'm not exactly sure what the villains are going to be like for this wave, but The Dark Temple, to me, sounds like a villain headquarters or something like that, and we can't really go off of anything based on just the name alone, because Dark Temple is a pretty generic name, but still, $79.99? That's not a bad price for a temple. I'm curious to see what exactly this is going to be. A dark temple. I'm hoping that maybe it's purple, dark red, black in color. Could be anything once again. There's not a lot to go off of here for dark temple, but yeah, that one does retail for $79.99. Then we have set number 71772, The Crystal King for $69.99. The Crystal King for a $70 set. Is this going to be some type of giant build or is it going to be like some type of, I guess, showdown between the ninja and this Crystal King character? Again, Crystal Crystal King? I, I don't know who that is. It sounds interesting. I'm curious to see what exactly this whole 
uh, scenario is going to be here for the Crystal King set. In my opinion, this sounds like a large action figure type build, which is always appealing to me personally. I love that kind of stuff. And maybe this could be a giant new villain for season 16 or whatever this series is going to be for, whatever this list of sets is actually for. But still, Crystal King, $69.99. Then we have set number 71773, Kai's Golden Dragon Raider for $89.99. Sounds like a massive Kai vehicle, and I'm down for that. That sounds awesome. Again, Raider could be one of those half-track vehicles, could be something different. To me, that's just what Raider means, one of those half-track vehicles, but it could always mean literally anything. But yeah, Kai's Golden Dragon Raider sounds fun. Uh, Golden Dragon vehicles, once again, could very well be some type of dragon-themed build, and a Raider for Kai, It's it sounds awesome. And this thing is going to be huge, since it's retailing for $90 USD. Sounds like it's going to be a pretty massive Kai vehicle, so Kai fans are probably going to be looking forward to that. And then we have set number 71774, the Golden Dragon, for a hundred and thirty-nine dollars and ninety-nine cents. A hundred and forty bucks for a dragon. We have not seen a dragon that massive for Ninjago before. This dragon sounds crazy. It, it sounds insane. The Golden Dragon, I'm not sure if this is going to be explicitly Lloyd's Golden Dragon returning. If it is, though, this thing is gonna be massive. A hundred and forty bucks for this dragon, that's crazy. I don't think we've seen a dragon that big. The Golden Dragon could very well be Lloyd's. Promo Bricks does say that it's probably Lloyd's Dragon, which, okay, if Lloyd's Dragon is now this big, you bet I'm going to be grabbing that one. 140 bucks. I wonder what that's going to look like in terms of a dragon. That's crazy. Just absolutely insane. And then finally, we have set number 71775, the Samurai Axe Mech, for $119.99. So 120 bucks for the new Samurai Mech. I mean, if it's going to be massive... Sure, I'll probably look at it. Um, the Samurai X Mech is confirmed to be Pixels, not Nia's, so keep that in mind. This is a Pixel themed set, which is always good. Nice to see Pixel get some attention every now and then. 120 bucks for the Samurai Mech. It sounds like it might come with some other stuff in the set. Maybe it won't just come with the Mech itself, which could be the same case for the Golden Dragon as well. But still, those prices are pretty crazy. Overall, guys, that's going to pretty much do it for this entire set list. Overall, this way sounds exciting. I can already think of a whole bunch of theories based off of this wave, so expect those videos to be coming very soon. And in terms of the actual sets uh, themselves, while we don't have images, they sound interesting to say the least. This wave is pretty expensive though. The cheapest set is $19.99 and the most expensive one is the Golden Dragon at $140. So I can imagine this wave might be pretty pricey for some people, myself included, but hopefully, hopefully this wave is worth that actual price point because they're asking for quite a lot this go around so let's hope it's actually worth it with that being said guys that'll pretty much wrap it up for my thoughts here today just going over the summer 2022 sets courtesy of promo bricks once again let me know down below in the comments which sets you are most looking forward to and which one sounds the most intriguing to you personally for me it's definitely the golden dragon 140 bucks i need to see what that looks like leave a comment down below talking about what you think about all of this and thank you so much for watching hopefully you enjoyed feel free to like comment subscribe all that fun stuff and I will catch you guys again later. Peace.